Hello and welcome back to another episode of VGLCom. I'm your commander, gaming psychologist, and today we will of course be resuming where we left off last time. We had just come back from our first non-tutorial mission, although I guess the first mission in Long War isn't really a tutorial, it just chucks you into a mission. But uh, regardless, we've got another squad out there infiltrating, we've got some research and stuff going on, so we're just going to head on over to the bridge which you can get to by pushing this handy dandy button. Commander, you're not going to believe this. Oh, we just picked up a signal from an emergency locator. Yes, please. It's definitely one of ours from the original invasion. I know it sounds crazy, but if there's any chance some of our people could still be out there, I think we owe it to them to find out. Did that Oh, cuz 100%. This is uh, from the DLC. You get some special weapons and it unlocks future quests based around those weapons or future missions. You and I both know we only had one other Sky Ranger, Commander. It's worse for wear, but this heap used to be Big Sky's pride and joy. Alright, we'll just carry on for now. We'll equip them as necessary. It may be possible to triangulate exactly where they took off from, but it will take some time. Commanders, these weapons are unlike any design I have previously encountered before. I could attempt further analysis. But the likelihood of us reverse engineering them appears low, regardless. Remember what Tygen said. Right. Strike These new VIP. weapons are one of a kind. If we leave them on the battlefield, they'll be lost to us forever. We're getting an engineer, which is good. And their status is vulnerable. So, vulnerable is still, I believe, three squads of enemy troops, but they're smaller squads. Uh, and then the enemy reinforcement timer takes longer to complete. So let's launch mission. Recon picked up a weak distress signal coming from this area. The resistance confirmed it's one of their codes, so we're moving in to provide an emergency extraction. We'll need to secure the area and escort the VIP to the evac point. Stay alert for hostile contacts from Advent City. I never distinguishes, at least from what I've seen, at different Advent Cities, so I tend to just think of most of the Earth being covered by like this giant megaopolis type city. So I got the frame hitching here too, I'm not sure why my frame rate's dropping so low. It'll be fine. It'll buff out. Must be loading in a lot of assets. My poor CPU is having to do all the work all by its lonesome. But we won't have chemists in this mission. He'll be sad at the chemist to other soldiers ratio featured in this episode. At some point we may be doing multiple missions an episode, but right now with our squad strength, that's unlikely. Menace 1 5, target coordinates incoming. Secure the VIP and proceed to the evac volume for extraction. Oh, good. Advent already knows we're here, so your position isn't concealed for the extraction. Yep, so the only person concealed will be Rage. Although, the enemies still have to find you, even when you're not concealed. It's not like in previous, where they knew exactly where you were. Um, you still have to kind of stumble on them, or they still have to stumble on you. But if you reveal them, then you're in line of sight of each other, and they can see you. Looks like you'll be doing some scouting for us, Rage, since you are concealed. I have eyes on the enemy. Alright. I can get on these buildings. Question is, do I want to? Yes, I will get the aim bonuses from being up high, but if there are other reinforcements outside of this street, I will trigger them early. Uh, 
you're a rookie. 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 Squatty. Okay, let's do run and gun. Yep, that triggered him. Thought it would. That's why I run and gunned. You watching? All right, let's disorient. I'm not gonna go for the buildings. Move, move, move. I may regret that later, but for now, I'm just gonna, gonna stick with that. No problem, boss. Alright, I'm gonna overwatch. overwatch. Whatever you say. Yep, overwatch. Got it covered. I'll sprint you up to full cover. Oh shit. Oh, that's new. Okay. I've never started the mission with the VIP. You always have to rescue the VIP. Uh that could have been a mistake. I guess we'll just have to hope for the best. She is in full cover, and they're disoriented, so. You know, she has the symbol on her head. If I'd have been paying better attention. I don't feel so good. Alright, you people just need to stop it. So much for being disoriented. Fuckers. Okay. I mean, you'll be revealed. That'll be a kill. Let's hold off. Let's see what damage we can do. How hurt are you? One health left. Okay. Yeah, we gotta make this work. Oh, shit. Okay. Alright. You're dead. I hope. You've got to be fucking kidding me. Nope, that is not good. You're correct. Oh. Poor tactical situations. Alright, no one's in Overwatch. Run and hide. I'm on it. Couch. All right, let's see if I can kill you with this grenade. Hopefully, I can. At least she's not flanked anymore. Up here. I have little confidence that, that, that. Rando is going to make it through. What's your name? Alice. I have little confidence that Alice is going to make it through. But we'll hope for the best. We're just going to take a shot, and we're going to hope for the best. Nope. Get it together. I'm going. Nope. Good. 
Alright, um... I mean, I can move into melee range on any of those guys. Wow, he can take that path and not be spotted. He's smelling too. Be cool. And rage. I'm gone. Thirty-two percent chance for a hit. Nope. Enemy is still up. All right. I guess it's up to you, Rage, to see if you can save her. Um. This will put me in cover to these guys. So fuck it, here we go. They're on to me. Yeah! I should have just led with that honestly, but I want to keep him concealed just in case. I'm... <laughs> yes, I am happy. Oh, he's marking her. Yeah, they're gonna try and kill her. Okay. That was close. It was close. Hopefully, you turn out all right, Alice. If you survive this mission, I'll play soldier dress up with you. Dang it, Rage! Alright, fuck it. We're going up. I think we triggered all the enemies. Didn't really do much. Take it, Grace. Barely registered. Burning through ammo fast. No problem, boss. Got a range of uh oh no, you're within grenade chucking range. Here, catch. That was cover that crumbled. Ah, <laughs> yay. Move you. Well, that does count as high cover. Still, let's move over here. I'm going. Good job, buddy. to the next high cover. Let's move already. She doesn't have any grenades, so I gotta give her a med kit. I'm not gonna like, use the med kit though at one hell. I don't I don't like that position. I really don't like that position, guys. Uh, I'm gonna move around to this side. My shot chances is so bad. Alright. Dion.
Yes. I'll take the gray shots. Oh, uh -oh Kyle. You have been marked. Overwatch. Goody. Alright, she's bleeding out. Can work with that. Ah, full cover. Bullshit. God, it feels like so much bullshit. Uh, you don't have a med kit. Man, I gotta move up. And I'm gonna trigger an overwatch. Damn it. Alright, you're not gonna be my first move. Although I shouldn't trigger the overwatch with you, because you've got the aim bonus. Right, let's trigger it with Dion. Let's run up here to the spool cover. Please miss. Please miss. Oh, two overwatches. Right, you're alright. He's got a med kit. Rage has a med kit. Is that my only med kit? All right, Rage, I guess uh, you're on healing duty. What's over there? That should be standing right next to her. Shit. Um Okay. We'll overwatch. We'll do that next turn. I'm going. Alright, get him, Kyle. You didn't get him. Not even close. Could use some ammo over here. Seems doable. Take a twenty percent chance. Nope, okay. Shot wide. Run and dry on ammo. I hope it's worth it. I'm not sure how they don't break their legs. That's way too far to just drop off of a building and be fine. I think there's a grenade in there. Oh, what about a flashbang? Oh. It's the same. I've actually got a chance of killing that guy. Nope. Not good. I need ammo. Oh no. Just just went from bad to worse. Yep, this just went from real bad to real worse, guys. I think we're gonna have our first deaths. Taking heavy fire. Just break that wall. Um, let's see if we can extract the VIP. At least we'll get something out of this. Ah, Forty seven. I'll be flanking him if I move over here. But then I run serious risk of getting killed if I don't kill him. On your order. 
but let's do it. Please give me a crit. Not a crit. I'm running low on ammo. No problem, boss. That's a guaranteed kill. So I'll take it. Yeah, loot destroyed. I don't really care at this point. Just want to bring my people home. I can handle that. We'll do Overwatch. Overwatch. Alright, fingers crossed. Alright, Psy Zombie, I can work with that. It won't move this turn, I can move up and chuck a flashbang. Ish. Oh no. Oh shit. Oh, you've got the med kit. You're the only other one with a med kit. Stop it. It's annoying. Okay. I'm going. It's up to you to save the day. Give me a flashbang. I'm so glad that works. That has saved me so many times, regardless of whether or not it does here. Whatever you say. Alright, please kill. Okay. Well, how about that? We are going to have some casualties this mission, Negative I think. Ammo, spent. That seems pretty inevitable at this point. If I can keep the casualties to one or two, I think I'll be pretty pretty satisfied with that. You got twenty eight percent chance of a kill. Obviously didn't get it. Oh no, Kyle. I am so sorry. Ho ho ho! Ho! Oh, still a chance. Please don't panic. Oh, my heart's racing. You know, I said last episode, yeah, it's not that bad. I've got the hang of this. Spoke too soon. Alright, you are not panicked. No one went on Overwatch. You have got to go save Rage.
Oh, but no, you've got to reload. Oh, no. Alright, let's try to kill this guy. Damn it. Honestly, the smart move would be for you to run and hide behind this full cover. Twenty-three percent. I could chuck a frag grenade. I'm doing it. Frag grenade, hundred percent. So wasteful in normal gameplay. Sorry, I'm being so quiet, guys. I'm really trying to think through. I don't want. I would have been okay if Alice had died, because she's just some rando, right? Who gives a shit? But I don't want, I don't want my created people to die. Oh damn it! You panicked, Cube. Be cool. You're not being cool. Oh no! No mind control. Did it miss? Oh panic. Okay, hunker down. All right. Nothing's broken. You're fine. <laughs> You're fine. Walk it off. Nope. We'll worry about getting you guys later. Damn it. I was really hoping she could kill him. Alright, I'm extracting the VIP. At the very least, if everyone dies, I will still get this engineer. This is Firebrand. VIP is secure. Let's do this. And of course that dude's out of line of sight. This is it. So basically I'm just going to try and buy cube Need a light. the best chance he can, he can have. So between hunker down and disorientation, if he decides to try and kill cube, he might have a chance. Alright, we're reloading. I think I'm out of med kits. I think Cube is dead. <laughs> but he's not panicked anymore. That's good. I can handle that. All right, you're dead. Fuck you. Super fuck you. No problem, boss. All right, you should be. This should be. No, oh, it's cover mechanics. See, that should be exposed for a critical hit. Yeah, I know. 
All right, here's what we're gonna do. Uh, we are just gonna start extracting. Oh, that's interesting. She takes her helmet off to carry it, dude. All right, we're gonna get the VIP. We're gonna keep Rage. I am so sorry, Cube, that I don't have any more med kits. Lucas is dead. He just got he just got smoked. Yep, headshot. No need to ask twice. <laughs> I think I think we're just gonna gonna save who we can. We're fucked. Reinforcements are almost here. Kyle has only one health left. We're fucked. Abort mission, guys. Oh, God, I feel so terrible. I'm so sorry, Cube. I mean, those randos, fuck them. They're disposable, but... I mean, that's the last enemy, too. I, he just... He just reanimated someone. I'm on it. I'm out of here. Yep. Came home with only half a team. Four soldiers wounded, two kill. Rating acceptable. I mean, I don't really find that acceptable. It's what we got. It's what we have to deal with, but... Yeah, I don't call that acceptable. This is a black mark on my, my command skills. But I did promise that I would not save scum. If I was playing that by myself, I probably would have save scummed until I saved everyone. Having to face my failures, guys. This is good for me. <laughs> Every wound is so fucked. Oh no. No, oh, no. Alright, you were squatty already. So obviously, we'll go. Blade Master. Rookie and Rookie, so we'll go do Commander's Choice on those guys. Well, Asha. You're an engineer, so you're definitely worth trading three soldiers for, but boy, do I feel bad. Oh boy, guys. That was not good. Let's go ahead and do our upgrades. So Kyle, just like his fiance, Mel's, is a grenadier. And then, who's the other survivor? Dion. Dion is an assault. Alright, well, that is the episode, guys. Um, we're going to go pay our respects in the memorial. We can to honor our fallen soldiers, Commander. It's not much, but it gives our people a chance to pay their respects. Huh, we left Alice on the battlefield. She's not counted as dead. I wonder if maybe we can get her back later. I wonder if that counts as like a capture, because there are missions where you go to prison, advent prisons, and, and rescue troops. That would be awesome if she showed up on one of those missions later. But, let's pay respects. I'm going to take a screenshot. This is our first dead. 
in the long war. I salute you. Be cool. Change epitaph. Be cool was not cool under fire. He panicked and it got him killed. While he will be missed and was dearly loved, this is a prime example of what not to do when under fire. Sincerely, Commander. There. I'll take another screenshot so the epitaph's on there. That's the one I'll send. Be cool on Twitter. Once again, I salute you, sir, for your one mission and your one kill. Alright, folks, thank you very much for watching. I'll see you in the post roll. Thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why don't you think about subscribing to my channel or hitting that like button up there, I'd really appreciate it. If for some reason you didn't like it, feel free to exercise your right to hit the dislike button. Regardless of whether you liked it or not, I'd love to have some comments down in the comment section below. We can talk about whatever it was you liked or didn't like. If you want to find me in other places and support me in other ways, you can do so by following the link in the description to my Patreon. You can also follow the link to my Twitter page, or just go to Twitter and follow me at JMA4707. If you want to watch me stream games on Twitch, you can do so over at twitch.tv slash jr4707, and the link to that is also in the description below the video. If you want to hear me ramble on about video games for hours at a time with my partner in crime, Caffeine Rage, you can do so by following the link to our podcast, bglpodcast.podbean.com. Until next time, bye bye now.